Um, in this video, I'm going to show you how to make your own idle animation for your R6 uh, characters. So, first of all, just go to your uh, build rig, then select R6, and then click block rig. Then what you want to do is make sure you have it selected, then animation editor, click on it, name your animation. So, this is just tutorial. There you go tall then you want to make your animation so let's just make something funky so let's do my arms like this head like this I'm not just trying to make it sh a short video whoops Whoop. yeah I forgot these block rigs are very weird okay I'm gonna make it two seconds so I can make a nice loop. Go, go to one. Move the head this way. Arms come out. Now I'm just gonna copy the first one and paste it out to the last one. Select the loop thing. That looks funky. All right, then just gonna go ahead and select all of them. Because I want to smooth out. Then right click on the timeline. Easing style. Usually go with cubic. You can test out the others. And then in out. So now it's nice and smooth. Perfect. Now since it's going to be an idle animation. Click on the three dots. Then go to set animation priority. And then idle. Then you want to go ahead and export it. Save it as whatever you want. And copy this code, then open your browser, paste it in, copy the code up there. Here you go, copy the code. Then go back to your game. You can close out this. Uh, you can go ahead and delete the dummy now, since that's all you needed from him. Then, what you gotta do is load into the game. Make sure your game's on R6. Now what you can do is go to a workspace, to your name, and then copy. Just control C or right click and copy. Then you can exit out. Then go to your starter player, starter character scripts, control shift V, or right click and paste into. Then in here, what you want to do is then open this. Let me zoom out a bit and scroll all the way up until you find your idol. Go ahead and delete one of these. There you go. And then paste in your ID. Which I'll have to go ahead and copy again. There you go. Copy. Paste that in. Then go here. Delete one of these. Click on this. And paste. Now make sure the weight is the same as it is here. 9, 9. And uh, there you go. That's all you need to do. And I'll show you that it works. If I didn't mess something up, but I doubt that. <laughs> there you go. It loops. There you go. Move around. See, it works. Awesome. Thank you guys so much for watching. See you guys in my next video.